What's going on MTV? Welcome to our crib. Let's start with checking the outside first. So here we have our electrical external hookup. So just up there, you plug in and away you go. You got your 240 volts. So you fill up diesel there. We got your fresh water here. So literally just cap comes off, fresh water goes in. Then this is your external uh, gas supply. So if you've got a barbecue, a gas barbecue, you want to hook up straight in there. Uh, LPG, that's the, our gas uh, system. So in here we have our gas cylinders. Bosch. So yeah, we basically go to uh, nearest petrol station and yeah, just fill up the gas and away you go. Here we have our toilet cassette. So this is all the fun stuff in here. And then, yeah, just got to empty when it gets full. Here we have the wonderful garage. So it's currently a bit of a mess uh, because there should be our bikes in there. They're currently at the bike shop. Um, but yeah, we've just got our boxes of various uh, stuff in there, like electrical box and documents and stuff. So yeah, let's take a look on the inside. Uh, shoes off, please. So let's start with the cockpit. So these, all these seats, both these seats swivel round. So like this. Beautiful. And this one does the same. Spin a Rooney. And then you got yourself a nice little work table. So this pops out. Bosh. One over here, one over there. Oh, do you like it over there? There you go. Wonderful. Then I can just cotch here. And then this also makes a bed. So if you want to make yourself a bed, you just got to bring this over. Got yourself a nice little coffee table. Bosh. Also, we have two uh, seats here. So these are seat belts, one here, seat belt two over there. And you can make this passenger seat. We also have plentiful windows in here, about a million, and all of them have these adorable little fly nets to stop the insects getting in because we don't like spiders in here. And they also have blackout blinds. Nice. A little ice cream van window. We're in. This is where at some point we'll have a TV when we can afford one. Oh. Comes out like this. And apparently you can flip it that way so you can watch it from bed. I think that's in the right place. These are our control boxes. So they control everything from a button, water, electricity, gas, heating. They're there. And uh, now I'm going to show you the kitchen. Welcome. Got some lovely storage cupboards above here and all along, and all along, that's where all our stuff goes. Plenty of storage. 
on a fly net window, very nice. We've got a cooker. It's got three hobs, done on gas. Oven and grill. Mm -hmm. We have to take the shelf out when we travel or it rattles and it's really annoying. Storage. Lots of storage in here. This is where lots of our food is. Cutlery and such. Got running water, fresh running water, and this is our little sink. Best bit. Fridge freezer. Yeah, come on, get a look inside. See what we eat. All the best vegan food. Little freezer up here. More storage, just in case you wanted more. We got plenty, we got it all. This is also like a music system that we can use Bluetooth on. Uh, we can listen to music all around. Would you like to see the bathroom? Come on in. So this door is a magical door. It creates a room here. It creates a sectional area here. So this is our little ensuite. This side, we have our toilet area. So one of our bathrooms. This is a said toilet. Really great little knack about this is if you don't want to sit at this angle, you can sit at that angle. And if you don't fancy that, over here. Things I do these days. Got storage, all the things. Running water here. My makeup sponge fell down, don't worry. Get back up there. More storage in here. Dressing gowns here. Obviously, they've got a place to live. Then, this is our shower. So we've got a little rail up here for anything wet, which is great because we consistently have wet towels. Uh, this is, I didn't even know this. This has got a hole in it, it's a little donut shower. Um, and it definitely fits one person in it, but we don't actually use it because we use showers at the gym where we work. So we use it for uh, our cat's litter tray. And that's his little space. Now on to the best parts of the bedroom. So here you have the wonderful bed got all our storage for clothes in here so we got loads of drawers so this is where we just keep our wash bin and we have my two drawers which are here so nice big drawer all soft clothes as well love that it's the best bit got have a little drawer for my t-shirts and boxes and then we've got another drawer here this, um, this drawer actually goes all the way through to the garage, so it's like a huge drawer. Um, I think it's got Amy's costumes and stuff in it. And then we have Amy's wardrobe here. And then we have more storage at the back here, so these will open up as well. And then we have a TV bracket on the wall there when we, when we get a TV in the bedroom eventually. And then just more storage on that side as well. And then the best part about this is this comes out like so. And then you put this little bit of cushion just in the middle there. And then that makes your bed. And you've got yourself a nice super king bed. So. Wonderful. And there is a cat in here somewhere as well. There he is, living his best life. Come on you. He loves it in here, this is his favorite place. And then if you come on up over here, and look up, we have a wonderful skylight. So that's really nice to wake up to in the morning when you've woken up. This opens up as well, so you get a nice fresh breeze coming through got your fly net sorted. Right well MTV I hope you've enjoyed the grand tour of our crib. Now if uh, you wouldn't mind please 
leaving out the door that you came in from. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs>